Let's continue playing the way, episode 6, when we last left off. We finished the Reach's ending of the way. Now, though, we must go to the tower. And oh boy, the tower. So let us begin. Once we're in, we might not be able to get out. Are you sure you want to do this? We're entering the tower. Here we go. And here we are. And yeah, it's much bigger on the inside. And has crazy teleport effects. And as we go higher and higher, we're going to save here. The Arctura is the final enemy in the game. Not as tough as our last opponent though, so we should be okay. But the battle volume is getting incredibly loud, which I apologize for. Right, focus halved. That's not so bad, because it didn't hurt um, anybody we're likely to be using that with. So we'll keep the draws up. Switch you to loner again, absorb. Everyone must bleed, but apparently not today. Mince. More drawing. Attack, and we're gonna keep absorbing. Lots of hit points in reserve. He should not be able to stop. This guy should think this guy, thing, girl, whatever, should not be able to stop us. Self-righteous, just to prepare a resurrection shield if we need to. And we're going to try a tornado. Didn't blind, wasn't overly expecting it to, to be honest. Let's try a hurricane cut for the sake of it. Nope. Beneath the sky. Half focus could be an issue on Slade, actually, but... Not a worry here. Perfection. Draw. We're going to draw more X life. We're going to go moderate. Actually, why do we need to moderate mess men? We're not at all damaged. In fact, it might actually be quicker to revive Sawyer if she falls. Slade now has resurrection. Attack. Revive 2 on Sawyer. Attack. Right, let's go with Try Ultra. More draw. Attack, attack. 6, 5, 3. That is so powerful, we'll have one again next turn. Cruel and unusual. Headshot. Ooh, that went quite badly. Draw. Simply four out. Attack. All right, revert. Civil servant. Saviour. Doesn't matter, they actually fought out in time. Yeah, well, try Ultra. We'll have Panacea next turn if we absolutely need it, and Absorb. But based on things thus far, we're really not going to need it. Uh, Panacea. Another headshot. And she is transformed. Moderate mass man just on the safe side. Draw. Absorb. And that's one numb sacrifice. Alright, try ultra. Draw. Actually, no. We'll panacea again, actually. Absorb. Okay. 
All right, now Octur is powering up a little. Two moderate mass mens, though, should easily repair any damage. And now we can reset. Draw. Draw, and in fact, actually. Excellent. X life transfer and absorb. Judgment one is evaded. Trail trap. Draw. X life transfer. Attack. Enough foolishness. 727. Seven. I really don't see you lasting a lot longer. Slave attacks for 109. The Arctura falls. Receive 30 CTP, 3000 aura points. What is this? Give me a minute to think and I'll figure it out. Don't be misled. What's that sound? Don't trust them. It's not intelligible. Lance. I'll help you, but this is the last I can do. What? Come to me. Yes. What is this? Be still. You have journeyed far with a heavy heart. Do not be troubled. Your efforts have not been in vain. What do you mean? Serena lives. I knew it. Where is she? She has always been near you. Why haven't I seen her? You have. No way. Why didn't she speak to me? Why couldn't she tell me? Such action would have undermined the mission. Your task was too important to allow that. What task? The destruction of evil. The purification of the way. Serena has known this and aided you since the very beginning. She's been protecting me? Correct. You are both instruments of justice who serve to cleanse that which has been soiled. However, you and Serena are now in danger. What danger? Others are attempting to manipulate you in order to bring about the destruction of Serena and yourself. Ultimately, they desire to control the way. If your companions enter the cell at the top of this tower, it will be dangerous. Both you and Serena will surely die. Can't you stop them? Such power does not rest with me. Only you can stop them. Please, save us. What's going on? There are people on the, up on the tower. You're kidding. Goodness, you're right. This bodes badly. Ready, Lyra. Yes. Don't put your panties, you can do this. Right. Stop! Rue, I thought we lost you. Lyra, get away from that door. What's wrong, man? No one is going in there. Rue, calm yourself. Don't come any closer. No one is going into that cell. I want everyone out of here. I mean it! Rue, we just... Shut up. Get away from that door. Do what I say! I 
voice. Stop! Jira? What the? Why? Why are you calling me that? Because that's your name. No, that's not my name. What are you talking about? My name is Rue. No, it's not. You're Jura. You're mistaken. No, I'm not. Do you not even recognize me? I'm your little sister, Lyra. You're my sister? No. I don't have a sister. I have to get going. I have to find Serena. That's not gonna happen. What? She's dead. Dead? No, she's not. What do you know? I saw her die. Please, don't talk about it. I've nearly forgotten about that. Don't you remember, Jura? You saw her die too. Don't you remember what really happened on the Landerin stretch? It was a beast that came and killed all the children. Well, almost all of them. Two children ran and escaped the first attack. But the beast chased them down. It cornered them at the end of a rushing, rushing river. The beast was you. I remember Serena pleading for her life. I remember the crazed look on your face. And it was there you murdered Serena before dragging me into that river. Liar. I would never harm Serena. You're a flaming liar. Jura. Don't call me by that name. It's true though. I saw it all. I could never accept it though. Instead I made up a story about what happened. So I've been making up stories ever since. Don't you remember telling me how much Serena used you? She didn't love you. You adored her. She never really returned your feelings. Instead, she used them to get you to do things for her. Even when you gave her that wonderful pendant, she ran off to look at the stars with someone else. Burn me. I... I am Jura. I killed her. I lost in the forest while trying to find the other children. I had been invited to play with them that evening. Came across two men. One was dead and one was sword sticking out of his back. The other man just sat there, his facial features frozen, his eyes staring off at nothing I could perceive. When I got closer, I heard strange noises coming from him. But afraid until then, fear suddenly seized me. Surely it was his sword embedded in the other man. Even as fear gripped me, an intense desire to take the sword from the other man's back came over me. The sword slid out easily. It was light. So very light. Then I ran. A while later I found the other kids and I was about to make a prison known when I heard them talking about me. I was used to it. But then Serena joined in as well. I was hurt. Sad. And then... Rage. Anger. The sword was so light in my hands it was screaming for blood. What did you do with all the bodies? I don't know. I blacked out shortly after killing Serena and knocking a friend into the river. Her friend was me. I went once to get back at you ever since. I thought I was the only person who knew what really happened for the longest time. He always laughed or spat on me when I tried to tell him the truth. I thought I was a simple orphan looking for attention. But I knew you were still alive. So I trained with a sword and went out to hunt you. It's been many years since my search. And here you are at last. But. I've lost my desire for revenge. I'm sure you were tainted by the sword you found. Whatever became of it. I lost it. But I don't remember when or where. I just know that I changed my name to Rue shortly after. But if you're both Jira and Andrew, who's he? No, this isn't right. Who are you? I'm Rue. No, you're not. Rue of Lander was just an identity that I created. That's a lie. This is all a lie. Serena isn't dead. You didn't kill her. I saw her get knocked into the water. 
That's what I used to tell myself too. Truth is too horrible. I don't believe your truth. I have no reason to lie. Her of Landrin was simply a fabrication of my mind. This can't be... impossible. Impossible. That's not right. It's impossible. It's all fake. I'm Rue. Not you. Lance. Flaming Lance. Burn me. Rue. Gaius. You aren't Serena. Who are you? Answer me. I am your guardian. Your protector. I don't understand. We are good for one another. The perfect instruments of justice when combined together. Evil fears us greatly. Burn you. You wish to part. Why? Because all my memories are lies. What have you done to me? I have given you life. I have given you an existence. Were it not for me, you would not even have the capacity to create memories. So you know who I am. You are an anomaly. What you are called, I am not certain. Certainly you once had a name. But what it was, even now I do not know. What? It is lost. Burn you. I'll destroy all of you and your lies. Please reconsider. Separation will result in the end of both of us. Gaius will destroy us. I don't care anymore. I will resist you. Naturally. Pretty much, this is gonna be a one-shot kill, if I remember this rightly. This is no Farrafalian fight. Well, injury 2, 83 damage. That's the hit points, at the very least. Risk crop sweep. In our favor, blindside, Lana. That might be enough. 33 versus 80. Injury 2. Plunge did not drop. Drop slash. Critical. Destroyer slot plug. In his favor, admittingly, but... 44 versus 65. He's in the red. We pretty much got him. So let's link up. Let's link up. Let's just have a lunch cut. Backlash snapper. The final pass. Twenty versus ninety-four. Injury four. Goodbye, sir. Jeez. Here? Rue. Lance, what is this? Another deception? Why do you look so angry? Because I'm tired. I'm tired of this world and all its fake little people. You know what? It's not true. It's all lies. No, Rue. It isn't. The truth is just harder to accept. Stop talking to me. Just go away. If you step through this doorway, I'll be gone. Forever. Good. Am I so worthless to you? She isn't out there. Please don't leave me. Can I ask you a question? Anything. Are you afraid to be alone? No one wants to be alone in the end. I suppose I love Serena. 
even though she never loved me. Even though she was dead. That was someone else. It wasn't really your choice. This time, it is. You are my purest hope. It's time to end this. No. What? This isn't the end. I have no end. Rue! Stop! Let him go. No. I can't do that. I'm not giving you a choice. What a waste. So we come to the second of the endings. And there is a difference in this one. So next time... The third and true ending of the way. Until then. Dinner is served. Hmm, looks good. I'll save some room. I got something special planned for dessert. No, really. Just a little something I picked up at Celestia's Fashion Boutique. Hmm, is that right? We'll get to that later, though. Let's just enjoy this candlelit dinner first. It'd be impossible not to. I just feel so... I don't know. This place. This time. Seems so perfect. How about you? What does it feel like? A quiet corner outside the roar of the world. Yes. That's exactly what it feels like. It's wonderful.